day's gonna come which we all want when the words of the prophets will largely be ignored the critics party pen cuts you down like so and i believe it's time you pulled your soul out of the fire yeah i believe it's time you pulled your heart in from the cold Temples and ivory towers feel an emptiness deep within themselves. It grows a little more behind their guarded door. The every shining statuette placed upon their shelves. With each and every monument built up to oneself. If you reach the end of the road on which you see you. So against the bulkhead smash the splinters, you find the boat you broke. You'll slid in over dogs, piled up in drifts of snow. You find yourself standing there, and you're all alone. You find yourself standing there, you're searching for your home. in my enemy's door and I've heard it said that a revolution starts on the bookshelf but if you will change anything you must first go through yourself if you will change anything you must first go through yourself Every set of footprints that anxiously depart Find themselves at the end one day longing for the start And every man who's mining for a diamond in the dark Has overlooked the treasure in the chamber of his heart Has overlooked the value of what he carries in his cart Overlook the importance of each minstrel and his part. Matthew Fisher, he did help write some of this. Well, I went to the hardware store and I bought a length of rope. It's not my favorite way to get high, but I'm all out of dope. I tried huffing spray paint, I tried free basin soap. Well, I even smoked a banana peel in the rind of a cantaloupe But none of that was working So I took to jerking With that rope around my neck Hanging from my deck And it's a fine line Between ecstasy and death It's a fine line Between my greatest and last breath It's a fine line This kind of masturbation It's a fine Asphyxiation. <laughs> well, after 40 seconds, I knew I'd had enough. But my arms were sore from beating and I couldn't pull myself up. The rope started to tighten, I started to choke. Yeah, the devil started laughing, but it won't no fucking joke. Cause my mother, she might find me dangling from the deck. Stark naked with a heart that stopped in a part that's still erect. And it's a fine line between ecstasy and death. It's a fine line between your greatest and last breath. It's a fine line, this kind of masturbation. It's a fine line, autoerotic asphyxiation. And so it came to pass. Like the vision I'd seen 
My mother found me hanging there like David Carradine. A rope around my genitals, a rope around my neck. Well, I never thought that I'd go out like the guy from In Excess. But it's a fine line between ecstasy and death. It's a fine line between your greatest and last breath. It's a fine line, this kind of masturbation. It's a fine line, autoerotic asphyxiation. Never, never choke yourself while you're choking your chicken.